Hey everyone, welcome back to part 41 of Let's Play Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Thanks again for joining me today. So, we last left Ivor. We stormed the castle to capture uh, Thane Tedmund. The guy got so scared he crapped his pants and had a heart attack. He crapped his pants and had a heart attack right when Chinnabert was going to rescue him. So, with that happening, Chinnabert now has to find another way to gain King Alfred's favor. And he won't tell us the whereabouts of... Sigurd, our brother. So, what I think is going to happen is he's going to betray us. He will betray us, as it happens in every every time in this game. Somebody betrays us just when we think we're going to trust somebody. They're going to betray us. I think he will betray us. Set a trap for us. Because remember when we last, when I ended the game, it was like too quiet in the village, right? There were no guards. There was nobody around, right? So, I think he is going to betray us. He's setting up a trap because it's too quiet. Either that or somebody killed him. My guess is Folke killed him, intoxicated him, drugged him, something. That's my guess because Folke found out of his plan. He tried to betray us to Folke. So I think that's what's happening. So with that out of the way, let us get into part 41 of Let's Play Assassin's Creed Valhalla. All right. We are in Kent. It's funny how uh, the, the town of Kent used to be spelled with a C. But now it's spelled with a K. I'm guessing. Kent in England. Well, clearly in England. Let's see what Bassam has to say. I would say well met, brother. But I cannot shake off the needle itch of dread. Is something wrong? I followed the abbot here, kept him in my sight. But see? the monks, his servants, I have seen nothing of them. Dead? I do not think so. But there is no good here in this grave. That is such a cool shield. Look at that. The glowing eye. In his quarters. Come. Those glowing eyes. Look at that. Alright. Let's follow Basim. Why would the godly shepherd ally with the heretic? Kunibad is a man who craves power and position. With Tetman dead, he must find it somewhere else. There is truth in that. Keep your eyes and blade sharp. So where are we going? Called it. I knew it. He betrayed us. Your guests have arrived. See, I called it. I knew she killed him. Come. She heard of his plan. The dear abbot sent me a warm invitation. Said. My friends were eager to meet with me. See? It's early for supper, I know. But Kinnebert's ale goes so well with roasted lamb and cinnamon blueberry peas. I couldn't resist. I don't know if that Where sounds any good. Like cinnamon and blueberry. Is he, Ew. is he not here? Cinnamon and blueberries, yes. In pancakes, amazing. Him. Cinnamon and blueberry peas? Never Ew. Secret. Peas with some Six. salt, garlic, Eight. and butter. Oh, yeah, a little Eight. bit of carrot. And let me tell you the tale of a man who talks with gods. You mock me. I've killed for much less. Of course you have. Isn't that the way of this ugly world? We call the sheep and thin the flock as we see fit, you and I. Most who walk the earth are little more than talking blood bladders. Wasted flesh. But not Sigurd. Sigurd is something else. Sigurd has been touched. He is deified. The gods, they speak through him. You lured him in with that lie. Your words are vile and blight. You should have listened, Avar. I tried to tell you. The gods are real and their power is within our grasp. <laughs> you will never find him. Not till I have had my fill. To old friends. This really is delicious, Kinnabert. Is it cloves I taste? <laughs> well, that concludes supper. Kill them, and bring their bodies to my sanctum in Canterbury. You ready to fight your way out of this? They will be upon us soon. Maybe there is another way out. Oh, don't do this to me tonight. No, 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 no. 
Hold on. Hey everyone, sorry, we're back. My game crashed. I got it back up and running. I don't know what happened there. I think there's a bug. There was an update on this game not that long ago. And uh, I don't know what happened there. But we're back up and running. It seems to be running okay. Um, it's on the loading screen right now. So uh, while we wait for the loading screen, uh, we are going to uh, just talk about what just happened a few minutes ago. Um, Fulke killed the abbot. I knew that was coming. I knew that was coming. Every time we trust someone, he tried to be... I bet you he tried to betray us, called Fulke, because she said that he was having some friends for dinner. Sure enough, we were the friends, and we got ambushed. Of course. So right when we were trying to make our escape from uh, the, uh, the, the priory or whatever you want to call it, um, we are ambushed by... Uh, by Fulke, uh, she ordered our deaths, and hopefully this will... Maybe there is another way Here we out. go. All right. Let's see if we can make our escape here. I was about to go up this ladder. Good thing it's saved right at that point. Map of England. What do I got in here? Anything worth stealing? Ooh, secret ale recipe. <laughs> okay, but where are you, bud? Coming or what? He glitched out. Now he's stuck there. Fulke no. let slip that her sanctum is at Canterbury. She did. And with no cause. I'd approach the place with caution. It may be a lie. It may be. But it's the only lead we have. I hope all this innocent sacrifice is worth the trouble. It's Sigurd. My brother. Of course it is. Damn then right it come. is. Let us dive into the maw of death. I was never keen on seeing my winter years. This will not be for nothing, Eivor. We will find Sigurd. It's not just him. I want Fulke to suffer. Too busy.
Please don't tell me we're walking all the way to Canterbury. I don't want to walk all the way to Canterbury. Hold on, let me see the map. And here we go again. This land of summer mists and forests, dreaming darkly. I see yeah. secrets, and I want to know England, all of it. And yet it rounds on us at every turn, snarling like a cornered dog. I begin to despair of ever settling here. Right. Perhaps the stars write your path, and you will never have a home here. Do you miss the land of your birth? I have long been away. But it is fiercely beautiful beneath the vanity, arrogance, and pettiness of men. I would love to see an expansion with Basim. That would be pretty cool. If we go back to, like, uh, Persia or wherever he's from. Oh, yeah, that's right. This started off as a Prince of Persia spinoff. But it is fiercely beautiful beneath the vanity, arrogance, and pettiness of men. I should like to see it. You could if you wish. My father was an architect, a builder of wonders. The great mosque of Samara, his masterpiece. Another man who played the caliphate's game better took the credit. He was exiled and died in poverty. Somebody's coming up. Somebody big. Yeah, no, I ain't going near him. Faith sours. What of loyalty? Shared stories round the hearth. Warm nights, bodies, and the tender love of another. There are some who are worthy. What's going on? My frame rate's not cooperating tonight. Mass. Men and women of vision and valor. Sigurd is one such man. He is. Fulke isn't wrong on that score. I fear for him, Basim. I cannot rest until he's safe. Nor will I, my friend. The practice of learning has waned considerably in England since yeah. the days of the Romans. What books they still have, they keep locked away in their churches, hidden from the eyes of common folk. Thralls and Gerald cannot read. What would be the point? They could learn. The church could teach them. So much of human history would be open to them. Aristotle, Pythagoras, Euclid, ancient knowledge. Now! Get the murdering heathen! Okay, continue your story, Basim. Aristotle, Pythagoras, Euclid, Ancient knowledge lost to all but a few hard-headed men of the cloth. You have studied these works yourself? In my youth, I was consumed with a passion. with a passion for understanding. I spent many hours a day in the House of Wisdom in Baghdad. A seminary? A great library full of the greatest learning of mankind. For a boy seeking answers, it holds many riches. One day, I was sitting cross-legged, devouring a study by the great astronomer al Khwarizmi. With the swiftness belying his years, the papers were plucked from my grasp by the great man himself. His presence stole my voice. He was kind and open-hearted. He showed me such scientific wonders. What did you learn there? Calendars and calculations placed Be gentle if they spot me. And five planets. Equations that crackled and sparkled with divine intelligence. I asked the great man, is this what it is to know? This place swarms with Fulke's people. Sigurd will be well guarded. Caution and subtlety should be our path. Ready? Follow me. The 
This place is heavily guarded. This is a trap. Why would Fulke give us her sanctum? She baits us. Cocksure and arrogant. But she cannot see failure in her path. Her fearful wit would say otherwise. Look at us sneaking along. Give me a hand. There We're we go. Still here. I will burn this Christ house to the ground. Guards, to arms. So we are to wander in like an ox. This must be the way to Fulke's sanctum. Then let us go. This is the place. Whoa, what just happened? Yo. Yo, my controller just disconnected. This is the place. It's riddled with the stench of her. Yo, I gotta pause. Like, this thing is going nuts. One moment. I gotta hold on here. Alright, we're back. Hopefully this'll... Did my controller disconnect? Wow. Sorry. I'm back for the third time. Tonight's been riddled with issues. I am so sorry, guys. First, the game crashes unexpectedly. Then, I get this weird glitch in my controller where my controller just freezes and disconnects and stops vibrating. And I couldn't even use my keyboard, so I couldn't continue playing without the, with the keyboard because it was still sensing that the controller was still connected. Like, this is insane. It's been a weird night. Um, I just realized... It's April 1st. It's April Fool's. I think my game is playing a cruel April Fool's joke on me. I honestly think so. All right. Back to the game. Let's see what happens here. Frame rate issues aside. That's another thing, too. I'm having terrible, terrible frame rate issues. And now, all of a sudden, it decides to rain. This is a trap. Why would Fulke give us our sanctum? Thank you. 
But yeah, I'm having like really bad frame rate issues tonight too. Like, why did it have to be in the middle of a rainstorm? It was nice and sunny 10 minutes ago. Oh, now all of a sudden there's guards everywhere. Jesus, what's happening? He give us her sanctum. She baits us. Cocksure and arrogant. She cannot see failure. Her fearful wit would say otherwise. To arms, Basson! So we are to blunder in like an ox? If she's still here, I will burn this Christ house to... All right, if uh, this continues, guys, I may have to end it. Nice decapitation there. the way to Fulke's Sanctum. Then let us go. I'm guessing is in here. Full K! I'm here! Face me! Have a care, Avery. You will play into our hands. What does it mean, these word tangles that speak of elves and demons? Let's see what that says. Hmm. Interesting writing. Could that be Old Norse? Details on the Order of the Ancients. Mm -hmm. Fulke ranks high among them, but is not the head. No. The Gospel of Mary Magdalene. Really? Plans to the great fortress in Wessex. Is there something here we can use to breach it? All right, let's continue on. Sick head. He's dead, isn't he? Now that's a torture device. in Sussex. The order trained soldiers there. We must be sure. Sigurd is running out of time.
Damn, son. Anything else? Documents of interest to the hidden ones. Hyden will surely want to look. But for Sigurd, Porchester is our only lead. Okay. If he is in Porchester Castle, we'll need a massive army to crack its walls. I have many friends in England now. If I call on them, they will come. They will. Basim, she severed his arm clean off. Can a man survive such a loss? Physically, he can. Mentally, it's hard to say. So much stress can drive a man to despair. If you suggest he might take his own life as Tebman did, banish that idea. I must tell my people at the settlement that their Jarl remains a captive. They will not take it well. We will not fail again, Eivor. I'll scout ahead and send word to the settlement when I know more of Porchester. Be ready. Will do. All right. Let us expand this skill tree. Where are we at? Over here. Nah, don't want to. That, that could be useful. Yeah, let's... Let's make our way up this tree. Oh, we can just go straight to world map. So where is Randvi? There she is. I'll fast travel there. Yeah, this is weird. Sorry, I'm lost in thought here. I apologize. Yeah, um, wow. Sigurd lost his hand. That is, like, I'm still trying to process that. I am still trying to process that. I don't know where this is leading to. Um, we're going to make our way um, back to Ranvi. Um, I think we're going to end this video here after that because um, there's too many issues going on right now. Um, I don't know what's happening. I got to call my internet provider because right now my frame rate um, is terrible. And I believe it's my internet that's causing interference with it because this game is a uh, always online type of game, right? So because it's always connected, it's always running. And every time there's an update, and of course more rain, because why wouldn't there be more rain? Yeah, the, the frame rate issues tonight, it's, it's unmanageable. I have to go. See you soon. Bye. Great Eivor. Let me join your crew for plunder and glory. Sure. Join my Come. crew. Show me your valor in battle and earn your place at the great table. Who's this guy? Oh yeah, they get the boat. Here. Welcome to our home. May you find a second wind here. One to fill your sails and send you across the world and back. That is an image I will fix in my mind, Wolfkist. Happy to be aboard. Only because 
because you all have such good taste. Now, this one, this one begins. Let us go report to Ranvi. She will know right away. Where is he? Where is Sigurd? He... he's alive. But not with you. Where is he? Dag, not now. I need to speak with Ranvi. You never found him, did you? Tell us, Eivor! We deserve the truth! I need to speak with Ranvi. Step aside, now! You never found him... ...because you didn't look! <clears throat> I see you, Eivor. I know what you are. Why aren't you out looking for him? Eivor, you come alone. I fear what that means for Sigurd. Unfortunately, I, yes. I could not find him. That madwoman Fulke, she... She slipped away. Took him to Sussex. We need an army. Call on our alliances. Remind them of their oath to me. We must act before... Before... Before what, Eivor? She tortured him, Radri. Did unspeakable things. Severed his arm and left it as a gift. I fear she means to kill him. Slowly. Yeah, exactly. Gods. I can't speak to uh, to uh, Ranji. Hi, Doggo. Mouse, how are you, my boy? Read new letter. Nice. I will definitely try to make it. Let's take a nap. Because we're going to have a weird vision quest, like some weird ass dream or something. He challenges me. I know he is. Maybe we have to continue this just a little bit longer if we're being summoned, challenged, so to speak. Face me, Eivor! Yeah, I knew it. Stop there, Wolf Kissed. This ends now. Dag. Turn around and walk away. Your habits are not my own, Eivor. I do not flee responsibility for the sake of my glory. I stand firm with my people. For many months, I have stood at your side, keeping faith in Sigurd's judgment, because I believed in him and his vision. Do mm -hmm. as Eivor commands, he told me. And I have. Against my better judgment, I did as you have asked me. And where has that left us? Without a Jarl? Without a purpose? Watching you chase glory around this land like a spooked hare! Oh, don't you dare. You could have come to me in confidence, Dak. But that offer is gone. I have no need of it! My mind is fixed. Hear me all! 
I challenge Eivor for the leadership of this clan until Sigurd is safe home. Why aren't you? Away, why aren't you out there looking no. for Sigurd? We fight to the death. All right, you asked for it. Hmm. I accept. We settle this now. Ah, a final act of courage. Very well. Let the circle be made. I'll crush you on their foot. has gotten you. Silence! <laughs> Goodbye, Dag. on this poor fool he forced my hand yes and the cost of disrespect is death you said it yourself that's right all he demanded you gave him that should be enough I have no need for one so fragile in my hall of heroes he fought for what he believed in does that not count for something does it you killed him all the same kill or be killed buddy what is the true cost of disrespect? The choice lies with you. We should not have come to this, old friend. Take this and fly to Odin's Hall. Whatever you sought in this life, You'll find it in the next. Go to your homes. I will lay him to rest. Go to your homes! Dag accused me. Betrayal. He accused me of breaking my oath. And this, this is the answer I gave him. Now you will hear the truth unvanished. None, none more than me wishes for Sigurd's safe return. You know this. You know this. All of you. And I will burn the fields. Dredge the rivers of Wessex. To find him. That! That is my oath! That is my oath. Damn. 
I will find Sigurd. You will not be without your Jarl, as I promise. Damn, son. That was epic. Derek, you lived as you died, proud and defiant. I cannot begrudge you for that. I miss hearing you tell your stories, old friend. But I remember them well. Oh, they buried him. They didn't give him a Viking funeral. You think on you often, Dag. I do hope Sigurd knows how much he meant to you. All right. We are beyond the time of telling such things now. Let us throw in those ability points. Where was I throwing them up? Up here. Beautiful. On the next one, I should get the heal on kill and no, the next two I will. Yeah. That looks like a good one to get. And. Yeah. Alright. On that note, my friends, uh, let's open up this quest log. Really interesting. Okay. The main quests are not there. All right, I guess I got to get some more. Uh... All right, then. On that note, I will save my game. All right, everyone. Thanks again for joining me. I apologize about all the weird cuts in this episode, about all the weird happenings. Um, it was playing a cruel April joke, uh, April Fool's joke, I guess, on me. Um, happy April Fool's Day, everyone, I guess. Um on that note, guys, thanks again for joining me. Uh, join me on this Sunday. Uh, we have part five of uh, the Lego Marvel Superhero Series. We're starting to open things up. We just uh, unlocked Wolverine. What a great character. I've always loved the character Wolverine. So we just unlocked Wolverine in that regards. We are moving on to chapter five. Um, I might. I, what I'm thinking is go through the main story finish that off and then go after all the little side quests and then go back and play the main campaign in free play mode on that um we just had a uh, this past tuesday we had the scott hall retrospective on the coffee and cannoli podcast we have a new one coming up this coming tuesday at 7 p.m so make sure you join us and the rest of the rlg cast crew for that or as putty likes to call us the podcast pals um yeah other than that guys thanks again for joining me we'll see you all next time and keep on gaming.